Hi friends, welcome to Pinot Kai. I hope you all are doing good. If you're new to my channel, then please subscribe and hit the like button and obviously share. Hello friends, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a beautiful tray with deco patch technique. I'm going to use this wooden tray. So I already applied one coat of gesso. I bought this rice paper from Itsibitsi Art and Craft Store. This paper is little thicker than paper napkin. It's very easy to apply. First, I'm going to find the middle of the tray and then I will use Mod Podge or you can use regular glue. This rice paper is little bit thicker so it will take longer time than regular paper napkin. So first I'm going to apply glue everywhere. If you see any bubble inside or if you want to re-adjust re the paper you can do until it's wet. If it's not sticking properly you can put something heavier on top. After it completely dry, I'm going to apply Mod Podge. You can also use diluted glue. I already mentioned about Deco Patch art in detail in my previous videos. If you are new to my channel, you can check my previous videos to learn more about Deco Patch. Okay, so here I'm using green and blue color because the print has green color. So I'm trying to merge the color or with the edge now I'm going to use white color to make little lighter green First, I'm going to do only inside the tray. I forgot to mention in the beginning I'm using acrylic color but you can use chalk paint as well. It's ready from inside. Now I'm going to color outside. I'm going to use little lighter green color. I mostly use this metallic color for my art project so I have these stencils and I'm going to use dabber and will dab very gently. And this is how I use these stencils around the print. After it completely dry it's time to decorate. I'm going to use this acrylic pen. So this time I'm trying to make it very simple so I'm just going to make polka dot around and now I'm using this metallic wax just to give a rustic look. After it completely dry I apply furniture polish or you could also apply varnish and here my beautiful tray is ready I hope you like this video if you like it please give it a thumbs up 